The Controlled Environment Hydroponic Research and Development Center was jointly initiated by the Agriculture, Fisheries and Conservation Department and the Vegetable Marketing Organization. It has served as a demonstrator of advanced hydroponic technology and facilities for the industry and investors. Last year, MAE joined hands with CSC in designing and developing an automated hydroponic system for the center. Currently, the growing process of seeding, germination, and harvesting involves the time-consuming manual labor of moving trays around, as well as dedicated tasks such as placing one or two seeds into each of the hundreds of holes of a hydroponic sponge. With the help of mobile robots and a robotic arm, most of the operations mentioned above can now be conducted automatically. Just by specifying a list of tasks, these robots will intelligently perform the tasks subject to available resources, such as the availability of the seeding robot arm or the harvesting machine, as determined by the software system. The mobile robots will then pull the appropriate trays out of the appropriate racks and send them to destinations. One key challenge of pushing and pulling trays lies in the millimeter level docking tolerance. Within a tight space, the robot needs to precisely align with the racks to smoothly guide the tray along the rails. This problem is solved by labeling the dock with fiducial markers and guiding the robot towards the computed dock position. Additionally, the elevator on the mobile base can precisely elevate trays to the exact rack level needed, inserting and removing trays as necessary. Multiple robots can work together to increase the overall efficiency. A centralized algorithm schedules a path for each robot. Generally, each robot will be assigned the shortest path to its destination. But when two robots' shortest paths overlap, one robot will move to a temporary waypoint and wait for the other to pass before continuing its navigation.